Beth from ScrappingWonders.com and I have a really super quick video for you today and I am just under the wire today for getting my video up for one video a day in July. I don't know what I was thinking when I signed up for this uh, challenge here. But anywho, I'm working in a traveler's notebook that I created for myself. Uh, I've been so busy making for customers but um, I made this one super quickly for myself and it's a standard size and I used the vellum bristol cardstock that I have uh, for some of my inserts because this is mostly going to be a scrapbooking insert um, I have decided to try and get back to scrapbooking I've been so busy with everything that I have forgotten my true love which is documenting my stories so my goal for this month is to not only do a video a day, but to also scrapbook once a day. So this is July 1st and I am using the Collect app and the Project Life app to make this happen for me. So what I do is I throw my photo into the Collect app, I export it and then I add it to the Project Life app, uh, the collaging for photos. And then I am printing out a regular 4x6 photo. One side is my photo and the other side is a journal card from one of the kits that I have in the app. I have quite a bit and um, that's because I used to use it a lot more. So what you saw me doing in the beginning was cutting my 4x6 in half so that I have two different photos. One is a journal card and you're going to see a little bit of hybrid action here because I write on my journal card and I embellish my journal card um, just like a regular journal card. And then I dug through my stash and I found this Hey Baby because I am scrapping little baby feet in this photo uh, and I'm telling the story of how my toddler wakes up and he is always ready to go. Literally. He wakes up eyes open he starts talking and he's ready to go so that's basically what this story is about I used the Chamel little by little six by six paper pad for some layering I have the notebook punch sitting on my desk so I grabbed that and I used my ruler to trim most of my pages down I used a slick writer for the journaling on my card because I am printing my photos on glossy paper. I don't have matte photo paper for the 4x6 size, just glossy. And then I used my Xyron sticker maker because I had some uh, acetate stars and I didn't want to see the adhesive through them. And when you have something like that, that is the perfect thing to use. I finish this off by adding some sequins from the Spiegel Mom Scraps shop, which she is amazing and I have quite a few sequins left from when I was on the design team last year. And that is going to do it for this first entry in my Traveler's Notebook scrapbook uh, insert for the month of July. This is entry number one. I hope you were inspired and thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos that I will be posting this month. And please give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Bye.